<laughs> Robin. Outside, we got Big A and Stalker Patty. Ah, uh, see? They're here to talk about their, their the, uh, the, end of one romance. Leads into the budding the of, another, of another the one. You know what? Another. I'm rooting for him. It's the circle of love, might I say. And uh, look at that mess sitting out there. Big A's got a tie on. Should we talk to him now, Anthony? He's he's dressed in a... Yeah, he's got like a button-down shirt and a tie. It's like Peter Brady's going out on a date. Well, they used to dress up in suit. We would go into a party and they'd be in like a suit jacket and yeah. ties. <laughs> All right, why don't we get him in here? Phil Packer. Phil Packer. I love that <laughs> his mustache. Here comes, uh, oh, my God. Here they are. Why Big A wow. and Starker Patty. Oh, no, no. You just, that's Hi. okay. Hi, Hi, Patty. How are you? They can How share a mic. All right. That's good. Um, oh, my God. <laughs> they look great together. Don't they? What a great couple. No way. Jesus Christ. Yeah, he's just giving him. Bill's just giving him some elbow room. Yeah, that's all. Get some elbow room. There you go. elbow room. Now you kids are gonna uh, go out tonight. It's uh, your first uh, date, really. It's a nighttime thing. Dinner at Paisano of Mulberry Street. Yeah. We love Paisano. Joey down there takes care of everybody, and uh, you guys are hooking up down there tonight. Yep. Wonderful. Now you've uh, you've had a little pre-date though uh, this morning. I hear you two had breakfast together. Yeah, we went to the Brooklyn Diner just to meet and then come here. <coughs> What's wrong and with I your voice? Eat, I have allergies. There's something in the air, like pollen stuff. Of course you stuff. do. You're like a fucking Yorkshire Terrier. <laughs> <laughs> like an aller allergic reaction <coughs> to oh, air. Excuse me, I'm sorry. She's Adrian from Rocky, I'm telling you. Yeah, only there's no hope of her ever getting better. Poor Patty. Stop, uh, stop the date. <laughs> <laughs> Patty, <laughs> seems, Patty seems kind of excited today. I, I see like a, a sparkle in your eyes. Are you psyched for the date tonight? Yeah, I really am. <laughs> Do you like Big A? Nothing. What? <laughs> Do you like Big A? They're, he's a very nice person. Ah, that's good. Very now, sweet. Now, I know usually the first thing people uh, go with, unfortunately, I'm, I'm going to say too, because uh, it's a shame when two nice people uh, get together, is uh, appearance. You kind of that's the first thing that draws you to people, even in the animal kingdom, Patty. Don't they look for the lovely colorful plumage of a bird <laughs> yeah. or the fur of an animal and stuff? So the, um <coughs> in that sense or the cock of a horse. The co <laughs> <laughs> Do they really look at that cock? I don't know. I've never really seen one, so Jesus. Uh, uh you, you, so, so I'm just, I'm just wondering, uh what is the physical attraction between the two of you? Now that you're uh, going to go out and get to know each other personally, uh, just right off the bat, though, how do you feel about Big A physically? Is he your kind of guy, your type? Well, he went out of his way to present a nice appearance with a tie and a shirt. You know, that's an effort on the part of a guy. And he's also uh, greasing his hair back, I noticed. That's pretty good. You slicked your hair back. Do you use gel? What did you use in your hair? Or is that just a week's worth of no shampoo? <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I used, um, Is that mic on? I don't know. You I know can't what? tell her. Is he just talking or not? His phone's going off. <laughs> Who's calling you? Hold on. What is your ringtone? Was that the Sex in the City theme? No, no. Oh, oh <laughs> no. no. It sounded <laughs> like it. Didn't it sound like it? What was I think it? It was. Um, I think it's. Uh, uh, All right, listen, uh, listen. Let him beat. It's a crackling mic. We can't, we can't have a crackling mic. Why don't we have good mics here? This is a here. professional talk show. Why don't we have good handheld mics here? Bill, could you just move down? Yeah, yeah. yeah Bill will move over here. Uh, Bill actually suggested that at first, but silly me, I thought there, were, uh, there was a mic they could use. That's all right. All right. I don't mind Bill in that seat. All right, go ahead. Go ahead, uh, Big A. What were you Big saying? Big A, uh, yeah, what yes. did you put in your hair? Um, uh, um, I shampooed it and uh, used uh, mousse. Mousse? Yes. Here's a little mousse, and yeah. that keeps it uh, yeah. all from uh, going flying out somewhere. And why the yes. tie? It's all frizzy. Why the tie? Uh, I wanted to put, you know, make a good appearance, and you know, yeah, look a little sharp and sharp. Yes, that's good. All right, and you got a uh, button-down shirt there. Nice little short yes. sleeve, little Jackie short Gleason sleeve. look. Yeah, a little Gleason. <laughs> That's the look. Very good, yeah. 
Yeah, the tie, the pants pulled up. <laughs> nice. So you you went out of your way, cleaned up. Very good. All right, back yes. to the first question, Patty. What uh, what do you see in Big A as far as uh, a physical attraction? Well, I see a very nice person inside oh that person. Inside that person. Screw and that. He, he looks, he has a very nice appearance. He's Are there clean. any of his attributes? Usually people go, oh, I love the, the person's eyes. I love their, you know, smile, something. Is there something you can compliment on him? Um, I would say, okay, he has nice eyes. Nice eyes. Yeah. There you go. All right. He's got serial killer eyes. <laughs> oh, he <really> does. <laughs> yes, he does. <laughs> no, I don't. Whoa! Oh, hey, hey, hey. oh, you going to take that from him? <laughs> What's this world coming to? <laughs> you got a set of balls. I don't get too mad at I like that, that Big A. A yeah, this is for you. This is for you, you Big go. A. I like that. You got balls. <laughs> Are you insane? <laughs> very good. What else, Patty? Patty? Well, he, nice eyes. He dresses very nicely. He dresses nicely. All right. Talked about that. Sure. And he's neat and trim. Neat and trim. Do you find him uh, courteous and polite? Yes, I do. You do. And that's something you would look for in a, a gentleman? Yes, I would. Mm -hmm. I see nothing mm -hmm. wrong with a gentleman holding a door open for you or treating you like a lady. And he does that? Big A, you yeah, do that? Yeah, he does. He treats you like a lady. Are you hoping he has a big cock? Oh, <laughs> Jesus, Opie. Uh, <laughs> not so... <laughs> um, that's not really what makes a guy a great guy, really. It helps, no. though. What's inside him that counts. Not what's inside you. It's what's inside him. <laughs> I got gotcha. you. I got gotcha, you, Patty. So uh, you, you find him a very nice person. Yes, I do. Somebody you would enjoy going out with. Yes, you know, and I like having company. I'm always alone, doing everything alone, so, so I like to surprising. do things with somebody else. And and there's definitely interest here, right, in Big A? Um, yeah, as a, you know, as a I don't what? really know. I don't as really a know him the that friend well. speech before you go out on the date? I haven't even been out on the date <laughs> yet. You, they're all horse. <laughs> I'm not. I see him as a very good friend. Yeah. Somebody that's a very good potential friend, uh, you know, and somebody to hang with. I'd rather hang with people like what that. What about uh, a romance? Is there a possibility? Possibility. Even. Wait, you still got to get to know him, obviously. Yeah, there's possibility. Are you keeping an open mind? You know, so. gay, protect yourself. Yes, I He's am. Rip your heart All up. things <laughs> are possible. Is that what you're wearing on your date, by the way? Well, no. I, it's eighty. Going to be eighty-six degrees out. I'm going to go and get like a skirt to wear for tonight. You're going to get a skirt. What about the top, though? You're wearing this camouflage number, Spaghetti this urban strap. camo. Oh, I have pretty tops at home. I just need a skirt. That's Usually, all. those camo tops look really hot on a lady. Yeah, they usually do. <laughs> yeah, well, how yeah. come when I walk down the street, sometimes construction workers y uh, whistle at me and stuff, you know? You might. I don't think anything of it. I just, how are they whistling? Is it like, or is it? <laughs> <laughs> I think they probably think you're a plank of wood. <laughs> oh, no, <laughs> I really don't think I look bad for my age. I really do By the way, uh, yeah. good news. I think we're going to get you on Maury. Really? Cool. So, so don't have sex with him until you... <coughs> oh, yeah, that was really... Uh, <laughs> until you do the Maury appearance. <laughs> that might have happened. No, Maury's taking our idea about, you know... Virgins. Virgins wow. and stuff. And we got a 50-year-old virgin. You're going to be on Maury. It's, it's looking uh, really good, by the way. Cool. The producers are in touch with our show. That's exciting. All right, so all you physically you like his eyes. That's about yes, it. Yes, I do, and his I like eyes. his appearance. He what, what about his teeth? Well, I don't have perfect teeth myself. <laughs> True. For mini chiclets. No, I'm just. Uh, what else? I mean, there's. You know, nice. You nice know. pecs. You like his pecs. <laughs> his pecs. You like his ass. <laughs> oh, Jesus. I don't know. I didn't really look there. All right, Big A, Look stand at his up. hands. Look at his hands. I'm oh, more hold. into personality and getting hold. along with people up. and hanging. Up. Shut up. The voice hold, goes right Hold your you. uh, hands up to Patty. <laughs> look at those hands, Patty. Now show yeah. the other side. Do they look like uh, a man's hands that are maybe soft, tender, that you'd like maybe at some point? to? And I'm not talking in very intimate places, but maybe on your shoulder, 
your arm. Do those look like the type of hands? Yes, they that do. You would like. I right, want you to hold uh, Patty's hand. Hold Patty's me. hand for All me. All right, let's just hold hands. Get a little closer. Yeah, get a little closer. Those <laughs> mics move. All right, those mics get the, move. Get the couple. Get them a little closer. <laughs> hold hands. Go. There you go. That's wonderful. That is awful. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's what I meant. Sorry, I don't know why I said wonderful. <laughs> Jesus, Patty. That's good. <laughs> he's, he's not gonna bite. <laughs> All right. So, you. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I was kidding. It's a photo. <laughs> love how they're. No, no. Keep holding hands the whole time oh, you're in okay. here because uh, we got to see the clam factor <laughs> that sparks up. And, and oh. Big A, that's what you're wearing tonight, like eight hours from now. Um, yes. Well, where do you live? What town? The Bronx. You live in the Bronx. So yeah. It'll be a little rough to go back up there, mm -hmm. get changed, yeah. Yeah, of course. and then go downtown to a Paisano. All right, Wait. let's ask Big A. Uh, what do you see in Patty? We're looking for physical stuff right now. Right. <laughs> right. Go ahead, Big A. Oh, I guess I like her eyes. Um, um, her legs, very nice. She yeah. has nice legs? Yeah. You like her legs? What yeah. about those titties? They're horrific, I know, but. <laughs> <laughs> no, it, it. All right, well, that's my opinion. I'm sorry. What do you <laughs> think? <laughs> what do you think? Yeah, what do you think of her, <laughs> her body? Bill. You know something? <laughs> Bill is horrified. Bill's, not, Bill's uh, the first person that has been on this show on a consistent basis that is actually a sensitive, like, yeah. nice Why guy. Why add to the pain? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you can easily get some I cocky do. asshole in here who needs to be torn into asshole. <laughs> <laughs> Why that, you see that <laughs> hurricane right there? Yeah, the, the, you did a fucking like the montage of their life and like a weather kind of thing. That's it right there. <laughs> One hurricane after another, just hitting the the stalker right. patty beach. Yeah. Oh, I'm not a stormy person. Uh, uh, you missed uh, the point. I was defending you, <laughs> Pat <laughs> Patty. What did you put in your hair? Because the front of it looks a little matted down and and greasy. Oh. I she have a, like she got it I have a problem yeah. with frizzy, so I used the no frizzy after my shampoo last night. But it looks like I probably put too much in, but if I don't put enough in, it, it looks like I never combed it. <laughs> it. It's it's like pasted to your forehead and very greasy looking. Oh, I put too much in, I guess. Yeah. But if I don't, it looks like I never combed it. Yeah. Uh, it looks like you got caught in the rain or something. Yeah. Uh, yeah. No. Well, so I, you're going to get a skirt, and what about the top? I have some things <laughs> some home. Nice little off-the-shoulder number. Yeah, this I do. Summer. You're going to yeah. wear a bra? Yeah. Do you own a bra? No. I've never seen Patty in a bra. I don't have to wear any. I don't have anything to hold them up. Yeah, but you know what happens to those? Uh, not yet. It's been 50, well, 40. How, when did you develop? 14? Yeah. 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 All right, so uh, Big A, you like her eyes. What else? And her legs. Oh, yeah, legs. What else? Take your glasses off, Patty. Let me see you without your glasses. Oh, no, because I got a... Uh, Let me see. Don't worry yeah, about my it. My eyes are puffy from allergies. <laughs> it hides it well. Right, put your glasses back on. <laughs> and what's, that, what's, what's going on over there? She has a blemish. A little blemish it's action? It's from the eyeglasses. I yeah. have to change them again. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bill is just like, why the fuck are you doing True. this? <laughs> I have to see the eye doctor in a couple months. Is the anyway. next segment you bring like a starving kid in here and you hold a sandwich just out of his reach? <laughs> you know, who are you, Bill, to yeah. say that these two aren't going to hook up and find such happiness uh, together? I'm hoping they do. I'm not. I'm, I'm on this side. I'm just not going to fucking. <laughs> You're rooting for them, aren't you? All right. Well, so you like uh, her eyes and her I'm legs, the one who right? offered to pay for a cab rather than have him go downtown on a rickshaw. That's true. <laughs> well, I wasn't going to allow the rickshaw either. What about what about her ass and stuff there, Big A? Yeah. You like that? You hit that shit, right? <laughs> what do you think? A little rough, huh? Stand up, Patty. Let, let's uh, give him a little view. Yeah. Stand up. Yeah. Let's let's uh, let's get some and turn sideways <laughs> a little. <laughs> All right. She got, you know, something for 50-year-old. Yeah. Yeah. It's not hanging or anything. What do you she think, Big A? She has on booty shorts. Not yeah. Bad. She's wearing a <laughs> Daisy Dukes. All right. Uh, Patty, you want to see Big A's ass? Um. We were calling him David Dukes. <laughs> All right, Big A, stand up so Patty could get a, a look at your ass. There we go. What you, wow. Look at that, huh? 
What do you think, Stalker Patty? I got a meeting with Mr. Marshall. <laughs> right. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> and away we go. You are a bum. What do you, what do you think, Stalker Patty? <laughs> well, it isn't little. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> oh, but oh. everybody is built in all different ways. You the know? world comes in various shapes That's and right. sizes, yeah, each with their own special bigger, blah, blah, some blah, are blah, smaller. blah. Right. And uh, you have no uh, problem with someone being a husky gentleman, right? No. I mean, only concern is uh, your, your health. You know, how is your health? Your, right. You know, can raise your cholesterol, can raise your blood pressure, you know? Uh huh. You know. Uh, how, how's that going for you there, uh, Big A? You're right as far as the cholesterol goes? Um, he has enough in his chin to kill a horse. <laughs> 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 All right, Bill. There hey, you go. Bill, Bill, Take Bill, a Bill, jab. Bill. When in Rome. Take a jab. There, there we go. go. <laughs> you cruel motherfucker. <laughs> That's right. I was just trying to fill a lull. Yes, go ahead, uh, Big A. <laughs> cholesterol, good, bad. Yeah. Um, I guess it's uh, okay. I haven't had my yearly um, physical, mm -hmm. uh, but I am on my diet, watching my weight. Yeah, he's constantly right. playing Air Nintendo yeah, <laughs> with his thumbs. I don't know what eat. that is. Yeah, All right. It depends on what you eat. You are what you eat. You oh, know? Dr. Patty's talking. Wait, Dr. Patty, <laughs> yes. <laughs> it depends on what you eat? Yeah. All right, we're going to ask you guys some questions. Huh? You want oh. them to ask each other? Oh, yeah, of course. <coughs> All right. Um, okay, why don't we have Big A ask Patty the first question? Um, uh, Patty. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Derek's got something. Ah, <laughs> this, makes yeah. it, this makes it an official hack radio bit. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the all new dating game. We'll get this lovely couple, ask them, uh, have them ask each other questions, and then they'll be whisked away to southern Manhattan, the beautiful south of Manhattan, to dine at Paisano of Mulberry Street. But first, let's get them, uh, uh, let's get them to know each other a little better. Uh, Big A, why don't you ask Patty the first question on our list? Oh, um, Patty. Uh, 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 describe your uh, ideal evening. My ideal evening is to go for a nice little walk and then go eat something nice and do something fun. You know, like bowling or... Walk, go. nice, fun. <laughs> right? Yeah. Or a walk. Good. Take a walk. <laughs> right. You like, you like taking a little walk around the city? Yeah, seeing the sights, you know. What sights? Well, I like... Be more specific. You're oh. walking. What do you want to see? Or where? Or what Limpy. kind of walk? You want to go through Central Park? <laughs> Central Park is pretty. Pretty. We'll stop at the zoo and see the animals, uh, you know, because I enjoy stuff like that. Yeah. You know, or do something fun and exciting. Like What's fun and exciting for you? Well. AC? Playing some slots? Well, I enjoy that once every five or six weeks. I go on the bus. That's fun. You know, Big A is hoping to play walk. your slot later tonight. Hey! Oh, come oh, on now. And oh, I love no. the boardwalk. I oh, love the boardwalk. Three, three the lemons. <laughs> 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 yeah, when I saw the Photoshop, I saw three shits. <laughs> oh, boy, yeah. There you go. All right. Did we get an answer to that question, you think? Uh, describe her ideal evening. Well, bowling, uh, walking. Walking, fun. Yeah, yeah, I like the sea and the beach, you know. I oh, like going to the beach would be fun? Right. Yeah. I'd love to send you to the beach right now. Galveston. <laughs> 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 All right. Well, Little Italy is going to be a nice uh, walk tonight. Cause yeah, it's and it's San Gennaro Italy. Feast, too. Yeah, That's you got right. the San Gennaro Feast going so down. So we'll take that in uh -huh. over there. Oh. That's fun. By the way, I, I'm going down there tonight. Are I, you? Oh, I got to check this out for myself. <laughs> no problem. I, we need video of cameras Absolutely. down there. Absolutely. I want a three-camera shoot of this disaster. <laughs> They're going to Paisano of Mulberry Street in the heart of Little Italy. Yeah. All right. Uh, should we move on? Yeah, let's uh, move on. Uh, let's have Patty. Ask Big A question number two. Better known as Peter Griffin body. <laughs> if you had one wish, what would it be? 
If it came true, he would not be sitting here. <laughs> <laughs> Patty felt like George Carlin. <laughs> <laughs> See, I'm warm enough to this. <laughs> <laughs> you can't think of them as human beings. Oh, Jesus. That's oh, what I do. I just make believe wow. they're not human beings. They're props? Oh, yeah. Uh, for my make it easier. Sick mind. All right, go ahead. Ask that question again there, yeah. Big A. No, or, it's uh, Patty, Patty. Sorry, sorry. Yes. If you had one wish, what would it be? Um, I guess if I had a better job, a better oh. life, better job. A better life, a better job. Uh, better life is that's a little vague. Yeah. That can really uh, open up a lot. That's right. You got to be uh, more specific. What do you mean by a better life? What in your life would you like better aside from just the job? Yeah. Well, if I had a better job, um, I could. Oh wow! Live in yeah. better places, and uh huh. And that would get the better life yeah. by having the yeah. better job. All right. How do you do in job interviews? Hmm. Yeah. Um, actually, I haven't had a, a, a <laughs> job interview. I've been driving a cab a well, long let's, time. Let's, so let's, let's practice one. Yes. Okay. All let's right. Say you're. Uh, maybe you want to drive a bus. <laughs> All right. I'm coming in. So tell me a little bit about yourself. Where are you from? He's Mr. Marshall. And address me as such. Um, uh, I live in the Bronx, uh, Mr. Marshall. Can I, I got to interrupt because I have to acknowledge again, we have the funniest listeners on the planet. Uh, Mike G answered the question, if you had one wish, what would it be? To die now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is horrible. Uh, Poe's Bloody Gee checking in. Ah. He writes, can we report as a missing person now, or is it too early? <laughs> and it just goes on and on. <laughs> what kind of job would you like, Big A, if you could? What kind of job? Well, I don't have many uh, skills, you know, um... I guess an office in the job. Oh. An <laughs> That's terrific. That's terrific. An office job. An office job would be good. Yes. Like a cubicle. Yes. You go in, you deal with some paperwork, and uh, that's it. Mm -hmm. All right. Yes. All right. That sounds like a reasonable job. Sure. All right, so if you had one wish, what would it be? A better job. Better yes. job, new life kind All of right. thing. All right, why don't we uh, move on? Big A, ask uh, Starker Patty question three. What animal best describes your personality? Hmm. Animal best describes your personality. Wow. <laughs> now we're getting into something. I would say a hamster because they're playful, <laughs> they're, <laughs> they're fun, and they're frisky and cute. <laughs> Hold on, Patty. You saying you're frisky? No. Ooh. Oh, hey. Follow-up hey. hey. follow oh, question. Oh, yeah, follow-up question. Take a finally. Oh, my God. What did I get myself into? Oh, my God. <laughs> you got a hamster. If I can close this deal. He's got to get, you know what I mean? Yeah. Turned away people for 48 years. <laughs> right. <laughs> you, can, you could be the one, Big A. Hamster, huh? A hamster. <laughs> you know the hamsters like to... <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> they all the time. <laughs> no, I mean the fun part of them, when they like to run around and play on of the course. wheel. On a wheel. Risky, I have know, one in my playful. apartment. I drink out of a big glass <laughs> bottle with a metal tube coming out of it. And I run around in a circle all night. My second choice <laughs> would be... Sleeping wood chips. Yeah, shavings all over shavings. the apartment. My, my second great. choice you can would go be... go to the bathroom wherever you want. <laughs> <laughs> my second choice would be a cat because they're smart. Yeah. And I'm smart. 
Oh. Oh. Making wow. shit now. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, it's not gonna get any better than that. But what I want to do now is, uh, Patty, I want you to ask um, Big A the same question. Question three. Okay. What animal best describes your personality? Um, uh, I would say uh, a bear. Uh, uh, Ooh, tell him, Fred. Because, <laughs> um, uh, 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 I think, um, uh, more like, a, you know, a bear. Oh. Oh, all right. Well. <laughs> <laughs> wow. wow. I didn't get where he was going with that. Yeah. Man. yeah. Really, he, he brought it all back <laughs> around there. Because yeah. I nice think I'm... <laughs> Do you More have, like a bear. Are you hairy like a bear there, Big A? Uh, a little bit. You got the back hair going? Not that much. Not that much? No. <laughs> looks like What's the matter? Patty's salmon. yawning. Why are you yawning, Oh, my Patty? God, Patty. My allergies, that's all. <laughs> She's allergic to boredom. No. <laughs> <laughs> I have asthma and allergies. That's affecting me. Oh, my God. If she was an animal, it would be at the vet every day. You know. In its little carrier being taken to the vet. <laughs> I... I have flaws like everyone else, and man, I do my best to hide them from my chick at all times, and yeah. she is just open about her allergies and her yes. sores. And I got this from my glasses. I got an allergy. I got the <laughs> asthma. Right. Well, it's yeah. from the HIV. Sores, though. I got a yeast infection. <laughs> well, I don't know how, but I wound up getting the herp a while back. I got the herp. Hey, Patty, uh, would you like a hairy chest to lay your head on? Hey, how about that? Have you ever dreamt about that? No, I never saw a chest as hairy before. Well, you know, because you watch movies, right? Yeah. And Magnum you see guys with hairy Magnum P.I. <laughs> 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 you ever watch Magnum P.I., Fatty? He's like an out-of-shape Tom Selleck. <laughs> 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 and then uh, did you ever dream maybe of falling asleep with your head on a man's uh, hairy chest? Well, no, I'm not that physical a person. It's you know, not I'm talking about being physical. A lap or anything like I'm that. I'm talking about somebody you're you're involved with. You're already in a relationship. <clears throat> yeah, and, well, and you're yeah, falling in that asleep. case, yeah. But I can't stand it when a woman does it to a guy in public. I saw one guy who could hardly stand because the girl was all over him, and it was in the middle of the food court where I was working at the time, and uh, I can't stand that. You, know. you don't like that, huh? Then the girl has a pouty look on her face. I hate that. I would never behave that way. That's so stupid. All right. Wow. You know? No She's wonder so why you're virgin. <laughs> She's so opinionated. She's so opinionated these that days. That's, you don't right. like public you know. displays of affection? Well, I mean, display of affection, yeah, and stuff like that. But in but if you really got a kiss or anything like that, there's a place for that, not in public, you know? It you always think, embarrasses uh, me when I'm walking in the park and I see that happening openly. It's embarrassing. Uh, Big A, do you think you could give Patty goosebumps by just running your hand down her arm from Ooh, her shoulder yes. to her elbow? Are you nuts? <laughs> just try that. Just what? run your hand slowly from her shoulder to her arm in a like very nice... Oh, she's got a touch. <laughs> Does she got goosebumps? It Was... tickles. What does that do for you, Patty? It tickles. That's like a very nice foreplay there. All right, rip her top off now. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> oh, well, all right, I thought I was going to get right, you. Right. Go on there. All right, this we is... We need a pinball machine for her. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck her on. <laughs> all right, why don't we go to question four? Ah. Big A, ask Starker Patty question four. Um, Patty, what is your worst quality? Sometimes I worry too much and it tenses me up, so I have to learn to relax and solve my problems without worrying. What do you worry about? Oh, I worry about different, you know, problems that I'm having. What's the outcome going to be? Like I what? always land on my feet, which is well, really cause you're a cat. like a cat that you want to be. That's very good. Yeah, you know, a I'd mean, like to I take her. Can we take her up it. to the roof and throw her off and see if she really does land on her feet? <laughs> I'd like to try that experiment with you, Patty. <laughs> Oh, that's okay, Anthony. All right. That's something that's good in theory only. Oh, okay. yeah. Yeah. What do you worry about? Oh, I, 
you know, I just worry like a certain like a situation I'm in now where I'm a little behind in the rent because I was paying some medical bills. And <laughs> I gotta that, you know? It's going to oh. work out. Do you but... have uh, health insurance? Well, yeah, I do. I pay for it, too, and I get the most expensive one because I have two medical conditions. Right. But I mean, what's wrong with And then you? I'm also in a savings plan, so I get about $100 ripped out of my check every week, you know, yeah. to taxes and that. But I need the savings plan because there won't be Social Security when I'm older and I don't have anything else. How do you know there won't be? <coughs> That's what they're the, saying? Well, from the way I hear about it now, it's operating in the red. All right. And it's going to get worse. Very you know? good. What's your health problems, Patty? She has that ticker problem and oh, the problem yeah, well, with the mitral uh, valve prolapse, which right. is I'm on medication, so it's under control. And, and the asthma, I'm on medication and the asthma. for that. All right, well, She's got the asthma. Okay. All right. Why don't you ask uh, Big A the same question, Patty? Okay. What is your worst quality? Oh Jesus! We only have like an hour and a half left in the show. <laughs> <It's>, uh, <coughs> I'm teasing, of course, Big A. You're a very uh, nice uh, gentleman. Uh, what do you think your worst quality is? Mm -hmm. Um, I think my uh, speech impediment. No. Oh. Wow. Yeah. You think that holds you back a little bit? Yeah. Um, sometimes. Why? Yeah. Why would it hold you back? You think? Hmm. Oh, uh, because. I mean, I can't talk as well as everybody else can. And, you know, sometimes that holds you back. Yeah. Yeah, people make assumptions. They don't have patience to wait mm -hmm. for the words to come out. They think and, you might yeah. be retarded, you know, but you're not. You just speak yeah. strangely, right? Yes. Okay. Unlike Patty, who speaks fine and is retarded. <laughs> is I'm that teasing, of course. She's very intelligent, right? You okay there, Patty? Yeah. Were you nodding <laughs> off? No, I'm looking at this one. Oh, she's I, cheating. She's looking ahead at the question. <laughs> That's why she's so prepared. What's your worst quality? I'm a little uh, impatient. <laughs> <with things. laughs> All right. Oh, that's an interesting question. Yeah. Uh, Jimmy Jakes from Whackbag wants to know, do you think after the date, Patty will invite Big A to her habitual? <laughs> <laughs> well, not on the first date, no. No? No one comes no. into uh, I'm a decent your sex lady. pad? Well, if the date goes well, will there be a goodnight kiss? Oh, oh, sure, yeah. Ooh. That always culminates. You action. Know, at the end of the day. It's not really action. It's just a... Open mouth? Tongue? No. No, not yet. Peck on the cheek? Peck on the cheek. Or, or on the lips? Lips? Lip on to lip? On the cheeks, I guess. You know, you know. What about just a quick peck on the lips, though? If the night went well? If what? it went well? Yeah, I mean, everybody... Yeah. You know, Will you yeah. allow him to brush your breast as he's kissing oh, you? Oh, jeez. Not a grab, just kind of a, oops, ooh, look what happened. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that would happen, wouldn't it? <laughs> what, what happened? I just hold you on the waist, thumbs move their way up to the side. Right. Yeah, you know? Big A, you going to try some moves tonight? Moves. Maybe. All right. Maybe. Yeah. All right, where are we at? We are at question uh, five. Five. All right, who asks? Uh, I guess, okay, uh, Big A, ask uh, Patty question five. Yeah. We only have 28 questions to go. <laughs> 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 All right, go ahead, Big A. That's question five. He's trying, Opie. Oh, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> <laughs> All right, any time now. Question five. Here All it comes. Right, here Big A. Um, Patty, All right. you had a personalized license plate. What would it say? My personalized license plate would say uh, peace. Peace. <laughs> Yeah. Isn't Why? that so nice? Why? Because I like the word. Why? Why? I don't know. I just like peace, serenity. Like of cake? Calmness. Or which, which way would you spell it? P-E-A-C-E. -E. Oh, that kind. Okay. Oh, why? You thought it was P-I-E-C-E? I thought like <laughs> if a girl drives around with a peace, with peace, and it's spelled the other way, it would mean she's a piece of ass, you know? Like, hey, look at this piece. Oh, well, maybe you were. Maybe... Rob from Cherry Hill. She has the body of a kangaroo. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, uh. All right, all right. A personalized plate, but you don't even you don't you don't drive, right? No, I don't. Do you have a driver's license? I have a non-driver's license. Non-driver. 
That's yeah. uh, that's called an ID. Yeah, that's what I have from <laughs> Department of Motor Vehicle, and I hate the photo on it. I want to get it retaken. No, it'll always be a view, though. <laughs> you can't. <laughs> what, uh, Patty, why haven't you gotten a driver's license? Because uh, I have a fear of driving. Ever since I was a small child, I witnessed the car accident and have been afraid ever since. Yeah. I don't know. I'm afraid but a I will be able plow into an Edsel. <laughs> <laughs> you know, because I witnessed it. What happened during? What uh, happened in this accident? The same. I was very small, oh. and all I saw was the socks on the road and the shoe on the side, and I saw, you know, and I you was know, very young. It's only like five years old. Wow! You know, the same thing happened to Jim Morrison, and we got some great music out of it. Are you kidding? <laughs> He saw an accident? Yeah, and he saw Indians on the side of the road. It's the legendary story, and he thinks one of the spirits of the dead Indian went into his body. Hence, wow. he became a shaman and all that. Right, it's on the steam. <laughs> so because uh, but... Jim Morrison witnessed an accident at a very young age, we, we got some great music. You witnessed an accident <laughs> at, uh, well, oh, we it. get, um, uh... Maybe great spirit of hamster went in her. <laughs> um. <laughs> All right, so there was a shoe on the side of the road, so there was death involved. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> that was really an awful Indian impersonation. Ugh. Yeah. I know. Yeah, I'm going like, like, um. Uh, um. Besides, I get uh, wherever I want to go anyway. Uh, yeah, yeah, Who yeah. needs a car? <laughs> Huh? I could get anywhere I want to go. <laughs> Who needs a car? Who needs a Never car? Never had trouble traveling before. Right, right. I'm a human navigator. That Henry Ford was an idiot. She's a human navigator, Anthony. Yeah, you put me in any place in the country, uh, I can find and give a me bus a bus place to, get to out go of to, I will find it. <laughs> you will find it. And I read maps pretty good. Yeah? Yeah, it's how I used to find uh, certain places, you know, where I had to go for the take a different right. bus route. I would go Listen. get a map. And you know, Patty, that's something to brag route. about. That you read maps pretty good. That's good. Not yeah. bad. Not everyone could do that. I love maps. <laughs> I like looking at them in subways. It's fascinating. Oh my God. <laughs> wow. <I> <laughs> Is that one of your fun nights out? <laughs> let's, let's, uh, so what are we doing now? <laughs> I don't even know where we are. Book six. Question no, what? Two. Oh, did, did you ask? Uh, oh, okay. If you had a personalized license plate, what would it say? Mm, yes, big A. Cool. Big A. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know what? That's Represent. actually perfect. <laughs> it the really dice is. hanging from the mirror. Mm. Big A. Yeah, represent. Yeah. Represent. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You've got a lot of street cred. <laughs> that's good. <Yeah. laughs> oh, really nothing to say about that. <laughs> Patrick from Virginia. Big A's plates. <laughs> KD. Uh huh. Space. <laughs> F. <laughs> Wait. I don't, I don't know what they mean. K D space F C K R. That's very funny. You fuckers. <laughs> Holy shit. All right. Wow. Uh, should we move on, Anthony? Of course. Do we need to do six? Uh, All right. Uh, Big A, uh, ask uh, Patty uh, question six. Oh, she Patty. Kind of said that, mm -hmm. yeah. I mean, we kind of did that one. Yeah, last, what's right? the most important uh, All right, why don't we do seven? quality in your partner? But Yeah, why don't we do seven there, Big A? Oh, um, Patty, what are your turn-ons and turn-offs? Okay, I'll do my... I'll follow. I'll do it the the negative first and the positive follow it up with. Okay, a turn off would be a body odor. Ah. You didn't or not taking a shower, things like Patty, that. Smell Big A's armpit. Oh. Big A, stop. lift your arm. Big A, you uh, showered. Yes, I did. Use deodorant. He He's wearing cologne. So he should right. be fine. Give Lift him a little sniff. Arm. No. You don't have you to gotta, put your nose in there. Just you, give it a little sniff around. We're giving the you a free dinner. Smell his armpit. Get in there a little more. Get in there a little bit. He Put your deodorant. You know, Definitely. Patty, we want to hear. Yeah, get a mic like on right there nose. in the sleeve. Put your nose near the sleeve opening. And now let's hear. It's deodorant. Yeah. He, so, he wore deodorant. So he doesn't have the B.O. So he doesn't have the B.O.? No. 
Let's let's hey. let's be sure. Smell his ball bag. No, <laughs> Alfie. <laughs> Oh. Really now, Alfie. <laughs> you know, and then you know another turn off would be dishonesty. Mm-hmm. You know, um, another turn off would be you know sodomy. <laughs> <laughs> you know, dishonesty or insincerity. Right. And then my biggest turn ones. Turn ons now. Okay, I'm up All to right. the turn ones. Right. Um, I like a guy that likes to have some fun. Huh? You know, likes a lot of the same things I like. Subway maps, hamsters. No, <laughs> no like you know. No, we don't. I enjoy, you know, turn on a guy that likes, you know, to uh, go places like, uh, you know. No. Like, no. I like uh, spontaneity. <laughs> let's take a bus and go down. Spontaneity. What did you just say? Let's take a bus and let's just take a ride. Wait, and wait, go wait, down wait, wait. No, what did you say? You like people that. What? Spontaneity. <laughs> spontaneity. Yeah, people that are spontaneous. Spontaneous. Yeah. All right. All right. Uh, so take a bus to Atlantic City would be like. Yeah, just an like a spur of the moment. Let's go and let's yeah. you know Jump hang out bus, at the beach the today down. and stuff. You know. <laughs> All right. Well. Well, that's I love good. The I think Big A is good for that because something tells me a lot of the girls are taken by surprise uh, <laughs> when they go out with Big A. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of spontaneity. I like and Improvisation going on. You know, I never I, expected to be duct taped in a trunk. No. <laughs> <laughs> Love this guy. You know. Movies. Yeah, I like going to movies and renting them. I don't go to the movies lately. I lately I've been just renting movies. Why? What's wrong with the Home movies? Alone? Did you see the forty-year-old virgin? Not yet. I would like to go see that. Yeah. I, I do have a movie card where you know you. <laughs> you know, yeah. No, we don't know. Tell us about you your movie card, You get some perks please. with it. Perks. I, mean, I think this is the sixth movie I'm going to see yeah. since I got the cards. It's like so being I'll rated. They give you a room, a free beverage some with dinners. It. She's like treating the theater like it's the Borgata. <laughs> <laughs> what are you kidding? <laughs> some miles. Got a, my right. movie card. Why don't, uh, why don't you ask uh, Big A the same question there, Patty? Okay. Um, what are your turn-ons and turn-offs? Bad for voice. Tap, tap, tap. Actually, I turn, uh, I turn on, it's pretty much the same as yours. Um, a trust and, uh, and being loyal, mm-hmm. uh, um, trust right is very important. Right. And that turns you on? What Someone you can trust? Anything? Yeah, I don't know. These turn-ons yeah. are like, they're not like uh, <laughs> penthouse turn-ons, you know? Cooter Flap, Texas. Patty's turn off his cock. <laughs> <laughs> That's obvious. <laughs> How would they know? Ooh. All right, what else? Turn on. Someone's on. reporting that Represent has just been officially completely dropped by the black community. <laughs> <laughs> Never again use that. What other t- turn ons? Come on, Big A. Something good. Um. Uh, um, uh, good, um, good personality. That's a turn on. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Nice ass. Any of that stuff? Of course. Uh, good, you know, good you know, body. And nice ah, ass. Ah, nice ass. Yeah, good, good body. Yeah. Patty, are you a little taken aback by that? No, I do have a good body for somebody my age. She always puts that All on. Right. I like that. But what about your turn offs, Big A? We gotta move on here. Oh, you already said that. You said they're pretty much the same as hers. I know, mm-hmm. but I hate being, you know, lied to, and you know, and, 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 and people who are not honest and you're know, not truthful. You get that a lot. Someone's saying they want to ride to the Bronx and they really want to go to Brooklyn. <laughs> <laughs> who are you talking to? <laughs> All right, why don't we move on? <laughs> Jesus. Uh, Big A, ask Starker Patty uh, one of the last questions here. I like uh, question eight. eight. Yeah. Number eight. Uh oh. Go ahead, Big A. Uh oh, there's an ST. Could be a word. problem. <laughs> ST is the problem that Big A has. Go ahead. Uh, Give your best shot. Patty, if you were uh, um, stranded <laughs> on the, an island, what three things would you bring? 
Oh, I would bring my ex on radio so I could have the Opie and Anthony in the run of the show and music. I would bring my entire collection of Beatle albums, but that would be hard to play. There'd be no electricity on the island, so I would have to leave those behind and bring my books instead. And I would bring my cat. Uh huh. So your cat? Yes, Evie would be my companion on the island. Your cat, your books? And your XM satellite radio. Right. Brilliant. I can't bring my records because there's no electricity on an island. Of course not. <laughs> Couldn't you bring a generator? But they'd melt on the beach. Right. They'd be hot and sandy. What would I the... plug the generator into? Generator. <laughs> the accent she puts on these words. I know. And what about your XM? The battery's going to go eventually. Yeah. Got to replug that thing in. <laughs> That's true. Yeah. True. Maybe I'd bring a uh, recharger or and something. What happens after a couple of years, your subscription runs out, you don't have a phone to call and re-up. <laughs> and the recharger, you still got to plug that in. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. You'd be th your battery's going dead listening to the preview channel. Well, at least I'd still have my books to read. What's your favorite book? Um, and then her glasses break. I liked this Great. one book. By Bill Wyman called Stone Alone. That was a great book. I didn't know he was such a good writer. I enjoyed it. I also like a lot of like rock wives, you know, a lot of cult, cop, like what? culture, pop culture type oh. books, you know. I have no idea. I got a book about the 60s that my friend gave me for my birthday. That would be a good Hammer book of to the bring. God. <laughs> <laughs> you know? That's a good one. <laughs> All right, Stoker Patty, ask Big A the same question. <clears throat> If you were stranded on an island, what three things would you bring? Mm-hmm. Blow up doll. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Big A. Uh, 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 too late. You're stranded with nothing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, I guess... Um, of uh, either the books or magazines and <laughs> magazines, fucking waiting room in a doctor's <laughs> office. You're on an island, man. <laughs> You're stranded on an island. Something that's gonna entertain you for eternity. Magazines, you're three through it. I I get bored when the Popular Mechanics doesn't show up on time, and I've read the same one for a month on the shitter. You you'd be like one month in, you'd need new magazines. So magazines kind of stinks, like Patty's books. That stinks too. <laughs> Short sleeve dress shirts. Maybe you could tie, tie them together and make a sale. <laughs> uh, all right, that's all we're gonna get out of him on that one. Magazines, magazines, three times. <laughs> <laughs> you got three things. No, can't think of anything. You're so afraid of offending Patty with what you say because you don't want to ruin the chance that you have this this chance that something might pan out that you're afraid to say things like a hot chick, some fucking beer, the, the, you know, something the like beer's that. beer's going to run out. What are you going to do to go buy more beer? <laughs> All right. Very good. How about uh, a brewery? I want a brewery <laughs> on the island. I want a brewery on the island and a whorehouse full of whores. <laughs> then you wouldn't be stranded. All right, calm down, Patty. Patty, <laughs> you're fucking up my good shit. Exactly. Miss Book exactly. and an XM radio. All right, why don't we move on? All right, Big A, uh, it says on the sheet for Big A to ask Patty. We're just about done here. That last question. Uh, if I was to kill you, how 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 would you like it done? If he was to kill well, to you, to tell you the truth, I wouldn't know because I would be running away. Yeah, but no, the thing but is, the he has is... to. The end result is you are going to be killed. Right, he has to something. kill you. This is a this is a very interesting question that a lot of people have been asked in their lives. What way what would way? you like to have him kill you if right. you had to you be had killed to. by him? It's not even a choice. Right. <laughs> to kill me? Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, I don't want to die though. None you, of you, us you, you would die. be screaming that, yes, but <laughs> in the end, 
It would end. And, well, Big A, why are you taking notes now? <laughs> <laughs> Patty, you have to be killed by and Big you, A. And you have to answer this question. Which way? Which way? Uh, just put me in a room and starve me. Wow, Jesus. you gruesome, sick bitch. <laughs> <laughs> that could take about eight hours based on her frame now. <laughs> take away my sunflower seeds. Yeah, <laughs> just starve me to death. You want to be starved as he drops in every so often and just sodomizes you? <laughs> <laughs> your, your quickly dwindling body. So that's how you would want to go? Just yeah. be starved to death? Starved in a room. Starved to death, okay. Yeah, okay. That's a good one. That's a bad, that's a horrendous death, you know. Yeah, that's pretty Not having painful. water or anything like that. Yeah. You know what happens to your tongue? Woo! What? <laughs> Dries up. Yeah. <laughs> like leather. <laughs> Cracked leather. All right, uh, are we done with that, I guess? Uh, yeah, yeah, and then uh, Patty has a question for Big A. Yeah. Oh, this is a cute one. If my body <laughs> was a Godiva chocolate, what part would you eat first? <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead, Big A. You pussy. <laughs> <laughs> the tits, I love Hershey's kisses. <laughs> Sticking with the chocolate theme, I'd eat her ass. <laughs> <laughs> Bill Burr, everyone. <laughs> Come on, Big A. Big A, which part of Patty would you eat first? She's just solid Godiva chocolate. I guess her arms. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually creepy. Like, yeah, that is really murderer. Just snap them off and nibble on them. I'll him. be honest with you. It, like Patty said, it was a cute question. I didn't think it could get creepy at all. Yeah. I really didn't. You know, <laughs> arms, <laughs> arms. Just well, look snap them off. He has those choker hooker hands. Yeah, right? you could definitely see those snapping a neck. Why her arms, Big A? And then petting her afterwards. <laughs> I didn't mean to uh, break you. <laughs> <laughs> Why her arms? Uh, I'm trying to be polite. I'm not uh, trying to, you know, say uh, any, you know, uh, nasty body parts. You know, I figured, you know. So you wouldn't want to eat her ass? <laughs> Uh, I think not. Just a big bite mark, big toothy bite mark where her pussy used to be. Ew. <laughs> That'd be great. Eventually, uh, after we had a, some sort of a commitment, uh, <laughs> <laughs> trying to be a gentleman, <laughs> eventually get to her ass. <laughs> All right, we're just about done. The date's tonight at Paisano of Mulberry Street in the yeah. heart of Little Italy. We're bringing, uh, I guess Nathaniel's going to be like the chaperone. I've already chaperone, heard a bunch cameraman. of listeners are going down there to check it out themselves. I That's hear the cool. table's going to be roped off. <laughs> I, I think I'm going. What? Five o'clock? I think I have to go check this out That's myself. Great. I'll have a report for you tomorrow, Anthony. Oh, great. Uh, what this. are you guys hoping for on this date? <laughs> Let's start with Starker Patty. Friendship. Oh. <clears throat> and somebody to hang with. <laughs> <laughs> I love the sheepy horn. <laughs> Just friendship? What about a, a blossom, like a romance? A something romance. Something that might lead to something, so you're not alone anymore. Oh, I need a companion, so that would be cool. Companion? You're like her cat. Big A has your... his hand on his well, no. right now. <laughs> What's the most? Uh, what What's the most that uh, Big A can hope for tonight? Hey, everybody! Day? We're all gonna get laid. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. A sec. You know, we'll go out again. You know, and hang around, and I'll make a new friend, which will be cool. Ugh. Do you have any guy friends right now that you go out alone to dinner with? Well. <clears throat> I have my friend who I've been friends with for over 20 years. Is that from 1010 Wins, that guy? No. You're not friends with him anymore? Well, I haven't heard from Reynolds. He moved to Connecticut. Right. And uh, I lost touch with him. <laughs> Reynolds. <laughs> Reynolds. It's basically right up the street. It's not like he went to yeah. Arizona. Well, that's... He moved to Connecticut. <laughs> that's a whole nother yeah, story, Yeah, but I Reynolds. hope for friendship Tens and of miles away. And... All right. No, but uh, do you moved... have a guy that you go out alone with to dinner? A guy friend now. Occasionally, you know, like he gave me a ticket to you, t you know, to go see Paul McCartney for the fifth. You know, he's a married 
guy. I know that his, his wife, mm, too. Wait a minute. Oh, hey. You know, we're just friends. I uh, actually help him out on weekends yeah, in the help store. Him out, huh? What are we going to do about store, this? In the store, I sell things. Oh. You know? oh, I bet you do. Yeah. You know? I but sell. I've been friends I'm with silly. him and his brother for years and years. Oof. They dog sit for his brother. You know, he gave me the U2 ticket. All right, U2. So right, I'm going to see Paul McCartney right. and U2 right. on the 5th and the 10th right. of October. All right. So you're not giving up the snatch tonight or anything like no. that, right? Well, no. That Maybe doesn't a... come until much later when you really get much involved with right. somebody. But a peck on the I cheek? I value in it. Possible peck on the cheek? Of Maybe. Course. Maybe That's a lips. normal. An yes. open mouth kiss with a brush of one of those uh, boobs there if you can find one <laughs> <laughs> they're there Ophie. i can't wait all right and uh i guess that's it right oh yeah, well uh, sending what you, them off big a what are you uh hoping for tonight at the end of the day um hoping to have a, a, a good night um a good time um maybe a little hug a yeah hug. I don't, i'm yeah, I like hugging. Hugging's great. All right, if you like hugging, why don't you guys hug? Of course. There you go. Let's see. Oh. Big A, grab her ass. Yeah. <laughs> you yeah. know, hugging is fine. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with hugging. Yeah? You know. What if his dick slips in you? <laughs> no. When you're that, hugging. No. Could happen. Yeah. That uh, doesn't Big A's head weighs more than a whole body. <laughs> <laughs> you really have a giant head, man. I just realized that when they hug. Yeah. Hug her again. Yeah, look at the look, hug. Look how much the head takes up. Wow. <laughs> grab her ass. Grab her ass. <laughs> no? <laughs> All right. So you're up like a six-pack. Big A, what are you hoping for tonight? Friendship that might that turn into something else? Yeah. You're hoping for some action, maybe? Uh, uh, hoping friendship. for a blowjob? What? What, what? what do we got going <laughs> in your head? Well, friendship yep. and maybe something else. Hoping, <laughs> hoping she might touch it. <laughs> oh. Maybe. This is a disaster. Touch it. <laughs> all right, there just, you have it. Just a touch. That's all we're going to get out of these yeah. knuckleheads. Well, uh, I can't wait till they have their date and we hear about it. When we'll are we hear about hear? it tomorrow. Friday? Yeah, tomorrow well, we'll hear Friday. about the big date yeah. with uh, Big A and Stalker Patty. Have fun, kids. Paisano, Mulberry Street in the heart of Little Italy. Five o'clock tonight, the date goes down, right? Right. Did you bring the chocolate covered cherries today? Patty. I you, don't you know if promised. you mean strawberries or liquid, ch like cherry cordial. I want the cherry cordial. I oh, want... okay. I'll bring you some. I All didn't right. know what All you right. meant. All right. Gee. All right. Uh, uh, did, are you going to uh, give her something tonight there, Big A? Yeah, you got a little gift for her, you know. Yeah. Oh, I'm you do? On it. All right. He's Ooh. planning on some stuff, yeah. Anthony. All right. We'll get a full report uh, tomorrow from these guys. All right. Good job. Thank you. No hand jobs, huh? <laughs> Not Little yet. Full release? Nothing. No you, full release? Nothing. You know, that wouldn't come until later on in a relationship. Are you two expecting a happy ending to yeah. this? <laughs> <laughs> Be careful of the question. I know what it means. If, oh. If things go well, can we hope that uh, maybe Big A could blast one on your face? <laughs> <laughs> If things go well, there's always a second time around. All right. A second day. <laughs> Very the best good. best thing that can happen <laughs> right at this point. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Get the hell out of yeah. here, man. Please. <laughs> Please. There they go. The lovely I would say uh, maybe couple. they have a shot if this wasn't going to be a restaurant full of psychos. Oh, I'm <laughs> sure the listeners that show up down at Paisano will make the whole thing fine, right? Good job, guys. Good Patty's job. Shorts. Jesus. Christ. <laughs> Just the. <Jeez>. A... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that that same outfit would look so hot on. We did that once. Remember, we had some porn star come in with the. This outfit was ridiculous on this girl, and, and Patty happened to be in the studio. Put it on. So we made her put on the exact same thing because they were about the same size. Uh, and we had a before and after. Maybe we could find that and throw happened? it back up on Foundry Music. It was hilarious. I'd love to see Patty take those clothes and put them on like a real hot chick. Yeah. It would be amazing, the difference. Yeah. Her, they're pulled up to her nipples. They're. they're <laughs> Did you see when she stood up, her shorts, for some reason, the bottoms of them belled out so much you could almost see her snatch yeah, yeah, from balls underneath. Balls were going to come up. Yeah, it was like, yeah, <laughs> balls were going to come out. All right, what's up, Ben? Anything? Nothing? All right. Gene Simmons was supposed to call to apologize for blowing us off, and he is blowing us off again. That motherfucker. All right, well. Enough with him.
On the way, we got some uh, Hurricane Rita shit to get into, and also uh, we got some more Tara Reid audio as well. Oh, yeah. And uh, Bush, the president might be boozing again. We'll get into that as well. 